people find out I do card tricks, they want to know if I can cheat at cards. Well, the answer is absolutely. I wanted to get that out of the way uh, at the very beginning. So what I thought I would do is show you a game of chance, cheat a little, and then at the very end, I promise I'll tell you exactly how the trick works. Does that sound fair? It's a game of chance with four cards. But when I go like this, one of them turns over the ace of spades. Did I tell you I was going to cheat? Now the ace is the one you have to keep your eye on. The other three jokers, they're just there to distract you. And when the ace is face up, it's easy to spot. If I go like this, it's a little bit harder. I told you I was going to cheat. See, it's all about sleight of hand. If I can take a joker and switch it for the ace, or take the ace and switch it for one of the jokers, then you really don't stand a chance. Now I can try and make this easier for you. I can get rid of one of these jokers by palming it, secretly palming it out of the packet and putting it in my pocket. But when I go like this, I still have one, two, three, four cards because this is the game with one, two, three jokers and the ace of spades. Now I told you that I would tell you exactly how this trick works. Some people think I have another ace. I do. This is the other ace. And some people think I have an extra card. Well, they're right, I do have an extra card. There's the extra card. And some people think I have a secret assistant to help me with this trick, and yeah, I have one of those too. This is my secret assistant. And some people go so far as to accuse me of using mark cards. Well, I do use mark cards, but now you know all of the secrets.